Hi, this is BJ with Marine Parts Source Specialty Services. And today we're doing a little preventive maintenance on this 31 foot Tierra by replacing the hull anodes. So let's get them off. When you're replacing the hull anode, you'll be removing the nuts and then removing the old anode. And then be sure to remove any debris behind the old anode to make sure that it's seated properly uh, before replacing it with the new anode. When you're replacing the shaft anode, just remove the uh, hardware on it. And sometimes it can be uh, a little corroded together. So you can use a chisel and a hammer, but just be sure to uh, tap lightly. And then now once you have the old anode removed, make sure there's nothing on the shaft itself. Make sure it's clean of any debris and then install the new anode. When replacing any of your anodes, make sure you use the proper material for your environment. There is aluminum anodes, which are used for salt water and brackish water. There's zinc anodes, which are used specifically for salt water. And then there's magnesium anodes, which is used specifically for freshwater lakes and rivers. Since we're in a freshwater lake, we will be using magnesium anodes. You should usually change your anodes at least every 12 months or when it's corroded to half its original size to ensure that it's working to its optimum level. Be sure to like and subscribe. If you have questions about what anodes you need for your boat, give our ABYC experts a call at 866-388-0390. And if you're looking for a sophisticated upgrade or repair for your boat and are in the Port Huron, Michigan area, give our specialty services shop a call at 810-662-3752.